Hello everyone. So today I am going to discuss about some questions which are often asked in various postgraduate entrance examinations and also in NTA net economics. So let us begin with our first question. So the first question is when the marginal cost is equal to average cost, the slope of the average cost is positive, negative, zero or infinite. So let me explain it. See? This is the y-axis and this is the x-axis. The x-axis measures output. Now, this is the average cost curve that is AC and this is the marginal cost curve that is MC. And the marginal cost curve cuts the average cost curve at its minimum point. So, when marginal cost curve cuts the average cost curve at its minimum point, the slope of the average cost curve is zero. So the answer is zero. So this is our second question. The second question is, which of the following will be true for both monopoly and monopolistic competition in the short run? So we all know that in monopoly or in monopolistic competition, this is the average revenue curve and this is the marginal revenue curve and marginal cost curve cuts MR curve from below. So we come back to our question. The answer is price is greater than marginal revenue. See this is the price with price is equal to average revenue. So average revenue is greater than marginal revenue. So our answer is A. So the third question is the idea of indicative planning was first adopted in which five year plan of India? See this question seems to be easy but we are often confused with indicative planning and inclusive planning. So the idea of indicative planning was first adopted in eight plan and eight plan was the, the period is 1992 to 1997 and inclusive planning was during 11 five year plan. Okay, now the next question is which of the following measures the degree of monopoly power? Here symbols have their usual meaning. Means we have to say that which of the following formula shows the degree of monopoly power. Now we all know that the elasticity, price elasticity demand formula is So we all know that price elasticity of demand is AR by AR minus MR. And the question says which of the following measures the degree of monopoly power. Monopoly power is always the reciprocal of elasticity of demand. That is AR and MR by AR. AR means price. So our answer will be A. That is AR minus MR divided by AR. Now the next question is one of the essential conditions of monopolistic competition is the question said monopolistic competition and the answer will be product differentiation. And if our question says one of the essential condition of perfect competition then it will be homogeneous product. Okay. Now the last question is diversification of agriculture implies the answer will be changing the cropping pattern in favor of horticulture and floriculture crops because diversification of agriculture means when there is a wider choice in production of variety of crops in a given area so that they can expand production related to their activities. So our answer is Okay guys, thank you. Do like, share and subscribe my channel.